Hey guys, it's Christina. I have been taking care of babies all morning, so it kind of made me think about, see, look, there's one right there. Um, it kind of made me think about something I get asked a lot, which is how important is it that I eat my meals every two to three hours? Is it, is it that big of a deal? Thank you. Is it that big of a deal if I have four hours or one hour in between my meals? Well, this is what I want you to think about. If you've ever had a baby or adopted a baby or anything like that or been around a baby, um, you know that babies eat all the time, right? They're eating every two to three hours. Well, that's because when we're born, our metabolisms are perfect and we're hungry every two to three hours because that's how we are set up to actually be. Thank you, buddy. So when you have grown up eating one big meal a day, you know, somewhere along the line, after we were raised eating every two to three hours and we were bottle fed every two to three hours, somewhere in between then and now, we screwed it up. We slowed our metabolism down to the point of maybe even not even having really a metabolism. And that's really, you know, put a lot of strain on our bodies because we've gained a lot of weight because of that. So we need to retrain our metabolism. So it's kind of like a dog that has to learn a trick. You have to do it over and over and over and over again in order for that dog to get that trick. If you don't, if there's no you know, repetitive nature at all whatsoever, the dog's not gonna remember and that dog's not gonna do a new trick. I have a kindergartner who's learning how to read. So we're doing a lot of flashcards at home. So it's the same thing. It's being repetitive. We have to do those flashcards over and over and over again so that she gets it. So it's the same thing with you eating these meals. You might think, oh, it's not that big of a deal. I went four hours. But what if we're trying to train your metabolism to doing what it should do every two to three? If you're going four hours or five hours and you're thinking it's not that big of a deal, I'll double up on my meals. Well, then you're kind of violating two rules. And those two would be retraining the metabolism and portion control. If you mix two meals together, that's a bigger portion than what you're supposed to be having. So if you're trying to retrain your metabolism, which is one of the, my favorite things about the program that I use to lose my weight, the facts are if your metabolism gets back up to where it should be, losing weight is going to be a heck of a lot easier. So please keep that in mind when you're eating every two to three hours. If you're having a hard time remembering that, set an alarm on your phone. Nobody has to know what that alarm's about. Have a text message sent to your phone at the same time every day if you can do that. Have a little, put, put it in your schedule. Make sure that you're eating every two to three hours and they're small meals and if, they're, if you're doing your Take Shape for Life stuff, make sure you're eating one of your MetaFast meals every two to three hours. Don't double up. If you have to, I get that. But only do that under dire circumstances. Don't make a habit out of it because we're trying to retain, retrain your metabolism so that your body can do this all on its own and it doesn't have to rely on this food for the rest of your life. My name is Christina Ray. I lost 95 pounds in a little less than eight months. I've kept it off for 13, almost 14 months now. I went from a size 18-20 to a 2-4, and I absolutely love the changes in my body, my life, everything else. So if you want help losing weight, if you have some questions, please feel free to shoot me an email, send me a text, or call me. Um, I'm a busy mom. I have a lot going on, but I will respond to your emails and things as soon as possible. If you're interested in the Take Shape for Life and MetaFast program, I can help you with that. I can help you save a ton of money, answer your questions, and help you with anything that you want to know about that. So feel free to um, look me up. Use my contact information that's below this video. You can go to coachmechristina.com. You can send me an email at coachmechristina at gmail.com, or you can call or text me at 864-381-9049. Thanks so much. Have a great day. I hope you enjoyed this video.